This tutorial is brought to you by Moroli Design Services. Hi, this is Monica from Moroli Design Services. This video is to show you how to use the Book Funnel app if you do not have a Kindle or do not download to your Android phone. So you receive the link in an email and you want to go up here to the URL bar and you want to paste in that link. For the purposes of this tutorial, I'm using just strict work in progress. It's not a complete book at this point. You have entered your URL and you've now reached the book and you click get my book and this screen will come up. Now if you have an Android phone, Kindle tablet, Nook, whichever device you have, that's the device that you're going to select or you can have it sent to your computer. For security reasons we use BookFunnel because BookFunnel marks every single copy that they deliver to um, readers in order to make the books more secure in an effort to try and keep piracy down. So in this case let's try iPad and we will see how that works. Click on iPad and it's going to send this directly to your email. You have to select which format you want, whether it's Mobi or whether it's EPUB. If you're going to be reading the book on iPad in the Kindle application, you're going to need Mobi. And then from there, let's put in, I'm just going to put in my business address. And you have your address in there. If you want to be remembered on the device, you can have that checked. Um, I don't normally um, have Book Funnel delivered to my business address. So you've got your address in, you've selected your format, click Send Book. And it indicates that it sent it to you. So you can close this out, and then you can go to your email. And there it is. And if you have trouble opening the book, then you can uh, visit this link. It'll talk you through some troubleshooting points. So you currently have this book. You're going to download it to your computer. And from there, you're going to add it to whatever device it is that you're using. In this instance, it's for iPad. Once you receive the email, you want to download this file so you can transfer it to your iPad. So you would click the download button there and I'm going to put this in download. Some people have the directory for ebooks. Um, I don't normally download for my iPad. So you just find the directory that you want to store it in and you click save and it will download the book. From here you're going to have to sideload it to your iPad. I hope that helps.